What's up guys, this is Tampa Tech and currently we are preparing for Hurricane Irma which is a category 5 and it just annihilated the Caribbean islands. Uh, Miami got evacuated, um, as of right now Tampa has not been evacuated so we're going to stay here and brace for the hurricane uh, expecting uh, lots of water, flooding possibly, uh, of course power probably most likely it will go out um, it could go out for one day and it could be out for over over a week so we are we are just preparing for that and I'm going to show you my uh, basically my hurricane kit and if this if you live in Florida or you live in Georgia or even South South I think South Carolina is in the target crosshairs too of the hurricane if you guys didn't live in any of these states uh, hopefully this video helps you out prepare your hurricane kit if it does give me a thumbs up I'm going to include some of the tech that's uh, included in my hurricane kit, but of course I have the the necessities, which is of course bottle water, uh, sunblock in case we have to leave the house and we're stuck outside for a long period of time. I have a life vest for my son who's just learning how to swim, power generator, uh, it's coming in the mail. I ordered a power generator last week and Amazon has yet to deliver it, which uh, sucks. I got this portable stove right here that can run off the generator. But uh, I'm going to show you some of the tech end of things. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, of course, when the power goes out, you got no air conditioning. So how do you stay cool? Well, I got this portable uh, fan. You just plug into your phone. This is a micro USB. You just plug it in. And it lasts, it lasts a really long time. And believe it or not, it doesn't kill my battery that fast. I mean, yes, my battery depletes faster, but not as, like, not as quick as you think. And you do get a breeze, and it does cool you down. So, if you guys are interested in this, this is the um, portable micro USB fan. I'll leave a link. Oh, I'll leave a bunch of links in the video description below. So this right here is a battery pack, and it does multiple things. It has a built-in light. It has 120 volt inverter and it could power it has actually two AC outlets right here and it could power fans uh, it could power your laptop the uh, cigarette lighter ports 12 volt uh, right here has a USB to charge your phone you can turn this switch right here you can jump start your car it has the jump cables right here also back here is uh, air compressor so if you need to blow up a, a raft, I also have a raft coming in the mail because I saw the videos of Harvey, what Harvey did to Houston and Houston was underwater so bad that people had rafts, they had jet skis in the street, it's pretty crazy. This will blow up a raft in seconds. So I got my fan right here plugged into my battery pack and it tells me how much uh, charge I have left. Just press this button, I have 92% left. Oh here, turn on the inverter actually. Now turn on the fan. There we go. So it tells you the wattage. So right now the fan is using 36 watts. 72 degrees. All right. So if you wanna get it colder, here's a trick. And a lot of southerners know this trick, especially people in South America. You wet a towel, and after you wet the towel, you put it in front of the fan. See, 65 degrees, and it's going to get colder. And then you can wrap that around your neck to stay cool. I also have this power inverter for my car. In case we have to leave, I just plug it into here, and then plug this into my cigarette lighter port and then I could keep my laptop charged. Another great thing to have to check in on the news besides a hand radio is right here, a tuner, a digital tuner for your laptop. So you plug this digital tuner into your laptop and you can watch off-air channels for free. It converts the digital off-air channels to your computer and so you're able to watch it and it has a miniature uh, antenna uh, all in this box. So the only thing you have to do is plug this into your computer and then connect this off-air antenna right here. 
and get a good signal and you can watch free off-air HD channels on your laptop without any internet you just gotta run the program so right here this is the off-air antenna and it's plugged into this device that converts the digital channels so you can watch TV works pretty good and you don't need internet other tech that's also great to have in your hurricane kit is a portable TV and a solar and hand crank powered AM FM radio with a built in power bank. Another great thing to have is a waterproof battery backup pack and a flashlight. So this of course has a standard flashlight, press it again and it does the SOS uh, flashing. So you could just sit this up and maybe a helicopter or a coast guard that's flying over overhead can uh, see you and rescue your family. That's worst case scenario. But yeah, it's waterproof. And right here, there's a little cover protecting all of its inputs or some of its outputs. And you can plug in your phone right here to charge your phone. I got another, another thing I got is um, a micro USB rechargeable lantern. So. You just tap it to turn it on and tap it again, turn it off. It has a built-in Bluetooth speaker and you could charge your phone as well. So it's a battery backup pack and a lantern all in one. It's pretty useful. Kids might like this, you know, go to sleep with the night light on. Another good battery backup pack is a solar charger. So this solar charger um, is pretty cool. You got keep it in the sun, it charges the battery backup. Um, the battery backup is 8,000 milliamp hours. Uh, the LED right here is a two watt LED and you can charge two phones at once. So you could just remove these covers, right? And you got an output here and an output there. And I think it's, yes, yeah, five volt, one amp output. So it's a slow charge, but still you could charge two devices at once, which is pretty nice. And I could hit this button right here to turn on the flashlight. And there's two ways to charge the battery in here. Using the solar panel, using the micro USB right here. I think one of the coolest and the most important things to have uh, in your hurricane kit, tech related, is the solar panels. Now, there's no battery that's inside the solar panels. Uh, basically, what this does is, you know, in case the power goes out, which in a hurricane most likely will happen, the next day you'll have sun, but no power. So just hang this outside or hang it you know, near a window. And this is a 15 watt solar panel. You could charge two devices at once. You just open this up. You can see that red light right here. That lets you know that um, there's voltage going to that. Um, these outputs currently and I don't even have too much light in this room it's just I have a, a few LED lights that are on in this room and it's getting voltage currently so these are pretty good there uh, this is a 15 watt solar panel and it'll charge probably a tablet and a phone at the same time so uh, and it folds up pretty nicely just fold it up like that put in your backpack waterproof backpack and you can take it with you and keep your devices charged in case you need to call your family and friends. Now I plan to keep these battery packs charged and just rotate them using these solar panels. So my kids devices are fully charged um, at all times so they don't drive me crazy. And if your phone is not waterproof, what I recommend doing is getting a Ziploc bag like this one. This is a sandwich Ziploc bag and throw your phone in the Ziploc bag like this one okay and then that keeps your phone waterproof so these are just a couple of tech um, gadgets to think about to include in your hurricane kit if this video was informative give me a big thumbs up if you want more how-to videos like this coming your way go ahead and click on the subscribe button right here or down below and if you know anyone that this video will help, go ahead and click on the share button below and share this video to them and help someone out. And if you wanna check out my other how-to videos, click on this playlist right here. Thanks guys for watching and be safe.